Rolling gets stale the more you use it, meaning you suffer more ren lag and have less intangibility the more often you roll. In addition, backward rolls are now slightly worse than forward rolls. Back rolls have 5 more frames of end lag on average than forward rolls when they're completely fresh. Back rolls also make you intangible one frame later on average than forward rolls. Sometimes you'll be forced to roll away from the opponent to quickly escape pressure. Normally you'd have to roll backward and endure its higher end lag and later intangibility. But there is a way to roll faster and farther away than usual. It's called boost rolling. Just turn around, then within two frames, press the shield button. This should let you do a forward roll when you would normally do a back roll. If you shield too early, you'll back roll. If you shield too late, you'll dash and shield. You can boost roll multiple times in a row if you're consistent with it. But you still have to deal with the staling mechanic and increased end lag on each roll, so I wouldn't recommend spamming boost rolls. Even so, this is a good way to get around some of Rowling's limitations in a pinch.